guys, how you doing? John Monk for Go419, and I'm here in Finley at a new axe throwing spot here in Northwest Ohio called Axe Ventura. It's actually the second Axe Ventura in sort of the larger region. The original and current Axe Ventura is up in an arbor, but it was, it's owned by uh, Kenton natives who remembered Finley fondly for uh, driving up here during their childhood, and when they wanted to expand and have a new Axe Ventura, uh, they came to Finley and they just moved in to downtown Finley uh, about four weeks ago, mid-December, they, they did an opening. I'm joined here with uh, Brian. He's a general manager here from Finley. How you doing, Brian? Good. Yourself? Doing, doing pretty well. Thanks for having me. I threw some axes. I, I think I have like a 30% accuracy rate, <laughs> so I need to get some practice in. But uh, give me sort of the rundown of Axe Ventura, sort of how long you've been open and, and, and what are your hours of operation? Well, like you said, this actually is coming up as our fourth week. Um, we're open Monday or Thursday and Friday, uh, four o'clock till nine with curfew and all that. Uh, we close the doors at 10 o'clock. So nine o'clock is our last booking on the weekends. We're open Saturday noon until nine is our last booking. So we close at 10 and on Sunday noon until eight. So we close the doors at nine o'clock. Right. And then, I mean, as everyone knows, you know, we're both wearing masks. Uh, we're, we're in the midst of a pandemic. So um, what are sort of the precautions you're taking to make sure that people can still come out and have fun but also, you know, stay within protocol and stay safe. Yes, as you can see, I'm wearing a mask. Um, all of our Axe Masters have masks on the entire time that anyone's in the building. Um, we require all guests that are up and are moving about the building to wear masks as well. Uh, we have sanitizer between groups that we go through and sanitize all the, the axes, the tables, the stools, anything that the, the previous customers touched. And then, and then uh, Brian told me uh, earlier for the news story, uh, they're also making sure that, you know, they're only grouping people together that don't come together if they, if they agree to it. Mostly they're trying to make sure that the people who come in as a group, they stay with that group and, and they're, they're competing with that group. So I'm going to have more on this story for Go For When I Come Out Today at 530. But Brian's going to give us a, a quick little rundown of proper uh, throwing mechanics and, and, and how to get the, sort of the most out of your attempts. So walk us through it. Um, so you're going to line up your feet about straight shoulder width apart. You're going to take your dominant hand and have it at the bottom of the X. You're not dominant, right over. You're going to stick your arms straight out. You're going to come back right above your head. And you're just going to throw. So something just like that. Nailed it. And then that's for beginners. That's, yeah, for, that's for beginners. Very and first time. Once you're comfortable doing two hands, I will move to a one-handed throw for more advanced. All righty. And, uh... And uh, I believe you also said dominant hand with my right. So yep. you start with your, your right foot forward. Yep. And then and you just kind of step one -handed. in. Yep. Mm -hmm. One handed, you do your dominant foot forward, left foot back, and then you're just going to straight out, come back, and step and throw. Yep. And in all honesty, it took me like five practice throws to finally get the, get the rhythm down and sort of get the weight of the X and the rotation yep. down. So it's a lot of fun, man. So if, if you're in the Finley area or you will be in the Finley area, you have a new spot to check out. You're allowed to bring in your own food and drink, yes. if I remember correctly, because yep. currently they're, they're not serving any food or drink because they just opened. They haven't gotten their liquor license yet, uh, but you intend to? Yes, that's the plan. Okay, and so obviously it's a, it's a bit tumultuous to be opening a new business during the pandemic, but these guys seem to be confident that they'll be able to sustain through this protocol and once all the protocols are lifted, hopefully this summer, right? Um, that everything can get back to normal and this can be uh, a new hotspot for downtown Bentley. Brian, for thanks sure. for having us. No problem, thank you. All right, guys, and uh, check out my story at 5.30 later today to see uh, more on Axe Ventura in Finley. For now, I'm John Monk. Thanks for watching, guys.